went to Disneyland. One of the next things you learn in life is that everything you believed as a little kid is subject to revision. So I'm watching When Good Ghouls Go Bad because I talked about it in my last vlog. It's just so cute and cozy and I didn't realize it was written by R.L. Stein. So that's cool. I'm making some dinner. It's gonna be some rice and veggies. I'm just having another cozy evening, making the like most of these last few days of autumn because this is my last autumn vlog, so, or October vlog for this year. And it's been so nice. I like documenting it and sharing these cozy vibes with you all. So yeah, pretty sad about autumn being over, but it's okay because we're gonna keep the momentum going here. There's marshmallows, plus lower temperatures, which meant that you could wear that jacket that makes you feel sort of cool and hides the fact that you're built like a scarecrow in case you spotted that girl that just knocked you out. That is one of my favorite scenes, too, of When Good Ghouls Go Bad. It's just any movie that has a walking home from school scene, like in the autumn leaves, I live for that kind of moment. <laughs> Um, today we're gonna carve pumpkins with my friends later, but for now I've got this <laughs> peanut butter ice macchiato and I'm rocking kind of a hedge-toe shaggy cosplay, like low-key. So I'll see you later for pumpkin carving. We're walking with the pumpkins! Woo! We're gonna carve the pumpkins! They don't know that yet. Okay. They're afraid of it. It's okay. energy and like melancholy today so i'm just gonna chill this evening before the several days in a row it feels like that we have halloween things to do i've got my jack o lantern lit from last night and i've got a candle going i'm making mac and cheese i'm gonna be so taurus and just chill and vibe with my feelings and watch a movie so hang out in a cozy sad girl night with me <laughs> I'm going to bake pumpkin seeds that are left over from last night. We've got quite a lot in here. I'm just rinsing them off and then I'm gonna have to dry them and then I will season them. The fact that I don't have a strainer is making this so much harder than it needs to be because I'm putting like little bunches of seeds in my lemon press to drain it and it's chaotic. It's chaotic neutral probably because it's not hurting anyone well except myself but we're getting there drying the seed just a little farther <laughs> oh dear i'm gonna turn the oven to 350 because that's what an article online recommended and then i can get to my seasoning so i'm gonna do olive oil salt sea salt a little bit of garlic salt for flavor onion powder i'm literally never doing <laughs> that slow process again that was painful but they're here and they're as dry as they can be really slimy really wet still but we're gonna make it work
I won't lie to you, that was really more like 10 minutes that I left them. But that's gonna be okay, cause they're so wet, they need extra time anyway. So now it's just the point where I flip them. And then realistically, it'll do another 10 minutes or so, I think. So while the seeds are still baking, I pulled my trusty zombie Girl Scout costume out of the crevices of my closet. I'm gonna wear this tomorrow night for comedy wrestling, and I feel like this will be really fun to like do spooky zombie makeup for. And yeah, and then I'll do my fantastic Mrs. Fox costume for the party on Saturday. But yeah, I'm gonna lay this out so it's all ready for me in the morning because I'm gonna wear it to work in the morning because I don't have time to get costumized um, after work. What these are, by the way, are like little severed fingers that I sewed on a couple years ago. And it's funny because like this has been so blood splattered, but it's actually like kind of like fades over time, I guess. So I'm gonna have to hit it with some fresh fake blood. Ooh, they're finally starting to smell. But I'm definitely gonna put them back in after I jostle them up a bit. Yeah, just a little longer so they're nice and crisp. Oh, they're gonna be good. Okay, I think they're done. There's some that are a little extra crisp, but we don't mind that. I'm just gonna let them cool now and paint my nails. And good morning for real. <laughs> I just got my coffee and Ryan got these little paper straws, the little ghosts. So I'm gonna use that and it is festive and useful so that I don't ruin my makeup today. Mm. All right, like I said, I'm gonna rush from work later to the comedy wrestling Halloween show. <sighs> I'm not gonna lie, I feel like really crampy and like kind of bad um but i'll be damned if i let that ruin halloween weekend halloween weekend for me so um i'm gonna try to push through that and also what helps is like having makeup like this like i don't have to look happy so i can hide my suffering within underneath a costume but yeah so i'll just continue on with the day and then i'll see you guys later the wrestling thing. Bye. and I'm stressed. Nobody might show up, but I still have to clean my whole house just in case they do. Yeah. What? Are we gonna drink? 
I'm gonna drink it. Hi! <laughs> We've been cleaning for the last while and it's finally, finally looking better in here, so did the bathroom as good as it's gonna get ryan's playing some silk sonic it's so good i feel frantic and crazy because they get here in 15 minutes and i'm just starting to get ready it's just been like too much getting ready uh getting the apartment ready today so let's do our makeup let's look like a fox <laughs> Maybe the best it's gonna be. Oh, but I'll do like. Okay. You know I can I can live with this. I do like the white eyeliner. I always think that that's like when I do it, I always feel like it's really chalky and stuff. And like yeah, it kind of is. But like from a distance you know it's like kind of effective so all right i will i can do this this is fine it's okay it is okay yeah morning and happy halloween i slept so late it's like already like one but i need it i need the rest i'm just gonna make myself a really cozy slow morning i'm gonna make some tea have some breakfast i think later we're gonna maybe go trick-or-treating in this very well-to-do nicely decorated area of luca lake area region yeah but so for now i'm just gonna take it really slow watch some youtube just have a really nice cozy halloween day <laughs> my low effort last minute costume because I don't have it in me to go any harder this Halloween. So tonight I'm a little pumpkin for handing out candy and for meeting our friends for a little bit. And that's what I am. This is my orange dress. We're making do with it. I'm just tired. It's fine.
it is the last half hour of Halloween. It has been such a good October. I've done so much. I've done so much and I'm ready to stop doing so much. I think I need to chill and just recollect myself and be quiet and slow and yeah it's been a really really good October but I, I feel full and I feel ready for some rest. I have some autumn ambience on. I'm going to read the October country and just be quiet and still and cozy these last few moments of Halloween. So happy Halloween to everyone. I hope you were happy and safe. Thank you for going on this first vlogoween journey with me. I had a really good time doing it. So I'll see you again soon. Bye.